Y'all, it is pouring down rain outside and I was super excited to show you this home. This is, uh, I, I mean, I struck gold with it. I came down here to Texas and I literally struck gold. I don't know how else to tell you this. So what I'm about to show you is actually a container home. It's not really a manufactured home. It's not really a tiny home. It's more like a combination of the two. Now this is the Helm by Cargo Homes. It's actually made up of a 40 foot container on the bottom and a 20 foot container on top. Yeah, it's two stories, how cool is that? And then it also has a place for you to like hang out upstairs. It's like a little patio. So without further ado, let's go ahead and hop into this home and uh, I'll tell you a little bit more about it. All right, so first thing we're gonna do is check out the bottom level. I know I was just, you're probably like, Tim, why'd you go outside to come back inside? But that's why, so you can see. So now we are staying in this as an Airbnb as well. So, you know, if you're down here in Waco and you want to come get a feel for this home, which is really cool. It's not something that you can normally do uh, with the mobile or manufactured homes. It's not like you can come and stay in them, but here you can. So that's pretty neat. Now on the bottom level, you do have your little living space. As you can see, it's uh all ship lapped around and then it has a mini split it actually has two mini splits downstairs and i think it even has one upstairs then right here i'll go pull the curtains away these this is actually the end of the container home and it's actually a door these two doors open up so that's pretty cool now with the airbnb jen toured it on our airbnb channel so if you aren't subscribed to that definitely go check that out and uh, she'll give you all the information if you did want to come down here and stay. So pretty neat. Look at that. They even knew I was coming. <laughs> it's because I, I booked it. Anyway, so this one, it does have a little breakfast bar. Now these things are super customizable. And uh, I'll actually show you once once we get to the end of the video, they have a whole bunch of different models too. Um, not just this one. This one just happened to be my favorite when I was looking at it. So, but beautiful all the way throughout the home. And you got the big drawers. So no uppers, you do just have the shelving for storage and then coming back down the hallway you have your bathroom which has a tile surround it's the glass is so clear i didn't even see it it has a tile surround and then a really cool shower head it's annoying anyway and then you have some of the black shiplap in here and then some type of plastic board maybe I'm not real sure on that then you do have your toilet and your vanity and then you have the barn style door for the bathroom itself so pretty cool looking this barn style door also is here in the bedroom now this is the first bedroom downstairs and again it has the mini split in here which is blowing some really warm air out because i got soaked earlier so cold and then you have the built, I didn't even notice this, I thought it was a mirror earlier, but it's actually a mirror built into the door. And then on this side, you have a nice set of shelves, hang your clothes. So it is very small, it's like a tiny home for sure. And then you have some um, recessed or inset lighting, flush, flush mount lighting maybe, I guess that's what you'd call it. Before y'all start beating me up in the comments. All right, then there is an upstairs to this place and you have to go outside to get there. If I don't get struck by lightning, we'll go and do it. So you can see all the different, these are all the different models that they have to 
like available. Now it's not this place that we're staying, but they have the place that we're staying actually has all the homes. So that's pretty neat. We have to come up these spiral staircases. Then you have this is the upper deck on top of the 40 foot container. And then again with the 20 foot, which we're about to go inside, it has the doors that you can enter. So it's pretty cool how they stacked it up. I saw this thing and I was like, holy cow, we gotta go check these out. But they just have this thing set up. If you could, and this is actually a model, you know? <laughs> it's so, I'm wild by it. I'm a container home fan anyway. If y'all have ever seen the one, if you ever do like a Google search for container homes, they have this huge orange one. I'll probably go find it and put it up a little picture of it for you real quick uh, on this one, but it is massive. And uh, man, you talk about my dream home, that's my dream home. So this one, they have it set up as a little coffee bar. I know Jen is in heaven here. And then they have another little mini split. And then behind this little wall, are some built-in shelves. And then coming back here, it does have another bathroom upstairs. Again, with the barn door. And then coming into the bathroom. Now there aren't any tubs in here, but I'm sure if you are working with the manufacturer or the builder, um, you can definitely have a tub put in one of these levels. Or you can just get like a shower tub combo or something. All right, so this is the home. It's by Cargo Home. Again, it's a 40 foot container on the bottom, 20 foot container on top. It's 480 square foot as far as your living space. And this beautiful home is gonna start out at $130,000. So I will make sure to leave all the information for that down in the description below. If you wanna come stay at this beautiful place, definitely go check out our other channel. Jen toured it and she'll go over all that information for you. If you wanna check out another amazing tour, you can click on this video right here. Hey, as always, guys, my name's Timothy, and I'll see you in the next one.